Good morning and welcome to Morning Gospel Fuel with Mr. G. It is Wednesday, May 25th, the sixth Wednesday of Easter, and the feast day of St. Bede. Uh, he is a, a doctor of the church. Uh, he was a monk and historian, and he died in 725 and is the patron saint of English writers and historians. Today's gospel is from John chapter 16, verses 12 through 15. Let's begin in the name of the Father, Son, and Spirit, Amen. I have much more to tell you, but you cannot bear it now. But when he comes, the Spirit of truth, he will guide you to all truth. He will not speak on his own, but he will speak what he hears, and will declare to you the things that are coming. He will glorify me, because he will take from what is mine and declare it to you. Everything that the Father has is mine. For this reason I told you that he will take from what is mine and declare it to you. So we have the coming of the Advocate here, in which we see God, just the love of God, taking place. That everything that belongs to Jesus will be delivered to us through the Spirit. Um, which is just, again, should, should open up our hearts and our minds to really trust Him more than what we do. Notice at the beginning, it says, I have much more to tell you, but you cannot bear it now. How often is it that in our lives that we don't understand why this or that happens? Or what's going to happen next? Or why did this happen? And why that? You know, sometimes playing the, the victim card of thinking that we, you know, we can never get out of a rut. Um, but I know something that a priest had told me one time is to stop asking why something happens because we oftentimes cannot bear it right now but more so ask ourselves what for what for instead of why because God's going to use it to help other people in some way and so also whenever it comes to so not only can we use that in our own lives in our own life journey our, in our own spiritual journey of just trusting that God's going to use it for good. But it's also important to keep in mind that we don't need to know every little detail right here and right now. Uh, there's a lot of people that are very nosy and like to know what's going on with everything. And uh, sometimes we don't need to be told. You know, it just causes us more stress and anxiety anyway. So what is it that we need to do to trust the Lord more in what he is trying to tell us? And sometimes that might mean less. So have a great day. God bless. Keep it real. And follow us on the spirit. Amen.